Chemical Hair Relaxers Test Review for Cosmetologists and Barbers to Pass the Written Part of the State Board Exam by Beauty Health Travel Channel 1. The most common relaxers are ammonium thioglycolate and a. sodium lauryl sulfate b. thio c. sodium hydroxide d. disulfide 2. Thio relaxers a. have an acid pH b. are milder than hydroxide relaxers C. Do not break the disulfide bonds. D. Do not soften and swell the hair. 3. Thio relaxers have a pH above A. 3 B. 7 C. 13 D. 10 4. When relaxing the hair with thio relaxer, which chemical rebonds the broken disulfide bonds? A. Alkalizing agent B. Aniline derivative tint C. Neutralizer D. Perm solution 5. Thiorelaxers contain an oxidizing agent ingredient called A. Hydrogen peroxide B. Bisulfate C. Sodium hydroxide D. Boric acid 6. When relaxing the hair with thiorelaxer, always follow A. The client's instructions B. The salon owner's instructions C. Manufacturer's instructions D. Instructions on the Internet 7. When relaxing the client's hair, she needs to be draped with A. A towel and a cloth cape B. A towel and a plastic cape C. Two towels and a plastic cape D. Only one towel 8. To protect the client while doing thio relaxer, Apply protective cream A. Around the hairline B. The nape area only C. Entire scalp base D. Above the eyebrows 9. When doing a relaxer service, always A. Leave the front door open B. Wear protective gloves C. Apply to the hair ends first D. All of the above 10. To find out if the hair is processed a. Rinse the hair. B. Brush the hair. C. Call the manufacturer. D. Do a strength test. 11. Record the relaxer service results, the processing time and the chemicals used in A. Appointment book. B. Online. C. In the client's record card. D. In a personal diary. 12. What do hydroxide relaxers have as an active ingredient? A. Hydroxide ion B. Citric acid C. Vinegar D. None of the above 13. Hydroxide relaxers have a pH of A. 7 B. 13 or more C. 6 or less D. 4.5 14. Sodium hydroxide relaxer causes the hair to undergo the land ionization process whereby one sulfur ion is removed from a disulfide bond, converting the bond to a land ionine bond. A. True. B. False. 15. Land ionization leaves the relaxed hair A. Soft and manageable B. Conditioned C. Damaged and fragile D. None of the above. 16. Hydroxide relaxers are compatible with ammonium thioglycolate relaxers. A. True. B. False. 17. Hydroxide relaxers will come into reaction with A. Metallic dyes. B. Thiorelaxers. C. Aniline derivatives. D. All of the above. 18. Lantionine bond caused by hydroxide relaxers will never be reformed to a disulfide bond even if it is excessively conditioned. A. True. B. False. 19. To stop the action of the hydroxide relaxer and restore the pH of the hair, use A. A neutralizing shampoo B. Alkaline shampoo C. Ammonium lauryl sulfate D. Salt and water 20. The following is a metal hydroxide relaxer. A. Lithium hydroxide B. Sodium hydroxide C. Potassium hydroxide 
D. All of the above. 21. Which hydroxide relaxer is gentler to the scalp than other hydroxide relaxers? A. Sodium hydroxide B. Guanidine hydroxide C. Lithium hydroxide D. Potassium hydroxide 22. Guanidine hydroxide is recommended for sensitive scalp and it will A. Still harm and damage the hair B. Not completely straighten the hair C. Work well with metallic dyes D. Be compatible with dio-relaxers 23. Sulfites and bisulfites A. Are recommended for use on color-treated hair B. Do not completely straighten the hair C. They are compatible with dio-relaxers but not with hydroxide relaxers and metallic dyes D. All of the above 24. Relaxers that employ the use of dye relaxer, hot blow dryer, and hot press with flat iron are A. Hydroxide relaxers B. Thio relaxers C. Thermal ionic relaxers D. Disulfite relaxers 25. Relaxers that require base cream throughout the entire scalp to protect it from the high pH of the relaxer product are called a. No base relaxers B. Base relaxers C. Ion relaxers D. Thermal relaxers 26. Relaxers that contain the base cream in the product that melts with body heat, lining the scalp to protect from the product, are called A. No base relaxers B. Base relaxers C. Ion relaxers D. Thermal relaxers 27. Relaxer comes in three strengths, mild, regular, and A. Strong, B. Extreme, C. Powerful, D. Super. 28. To determine if the relaxer process has taken place, administer A. Base Shampoo, B. Stretch Test, C. Periodic Strength Test, D. Ammonia Water Test. 29. Before doing a relaxer, the hairdresser needs to check for A. Cuts B. Abrasions C. Diseases D. All of the above 30. Normalizing lotion helps A. Restore the pH of the hair B. Soften the disulfide bonds C. Break the polypeptide chain D. Serve as an alkalizing agent 31. Due to its scalp irritating nature, do not apply a relaxer to scalp hair until a. Last few minutes of processing b. It is red c. The hair breaks d. None of the above 32. Before each chemical service, the clients need to a. Vigorously wash their hair b. Use vinegar on their hair C. Sign a release statement. D. Sign the MSDS sheet. 33. Do not use shampoo before A. A conditioner B. Hydroxide relaxer C. Roller set D. All of the above Answers to the test 1. C. 2. B. 3. D. 4. C. 5. A. 6. C. 7. C. 8. A. 9. B. 10. D. 11. C. 12. A. 13. B. 14. A. 15. C. 16. B. 17. D. 18. A. 19. A. 20. D. 21. B. 22. A. 23 D 24 C 25 B 26 A 27 D 28 C 29 D 30 A 31 A 32 C 33 B